kept watching you play, Great Sword. The last two videos had fun watching you learn. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. I've been learning, though. I've been learning. What did you say? I did been learning. It's pretty fun. I've been enjoying Great Sword a shit ton. Not gonna lie. Really have. Fuck, missed. Oh, he's already pretty much dead, bro. You get a bit better? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Long sword is easy to learn high skill ceiling. Yeah, it does have high skill ceiling. That is true. That that is what I've noticed and what everybody has been saying. It's weird though. I feel like it's I don't know. Like mentally I'm not being able to do the same thing I I've done in terms of learning curve that I did for the great sword though. It's really weird. I don't know why, I feel like the movesets are not what I expected it to be. Fatalis, not gonna lie. Yeah, you need to be constantly applying pressure with longsword. Mm, interesting. Bro, leave me alone. I do see everybody doing that. Everybody that plays with longsword, I do see them all the time doing the same thing. Bro. He ran, he ran. I don't know, I still see Great Sword as one of the high ceiling of skill to play. Yeah, no, no, I agree with that, Happy. Uh, I agree with that. Uh, what I'm what I'm saying is, it, in terms of learning curve, I don't think it's a big learning curve. It does require some skill to, like, actually... I don't know, I feel like mentally speaking, it was easier for me to learn the movesets for the great sword than the long sword. But uh, it, it definitely, I feel like it definitely has more to it than the long sword. Like absolutely. Let's get Diablos. Let's get normal Diablos. Let's get normal Diablos. Let's make use out of this one. Since it's the last one, boys. Come on, get Diablos first. For Nizov, he's gonna be good for sure. No, Nizov. Let's get Diablo. Well, but that's that's what I'm saying, Happy. Okay, let me let me see if I can get my, my points uh, straight. Of course, I'm not using all the 65% of the... Great sword movements. Uh, I've played great sword three times so far, so that's kind of normal. And I think for three times of playing great sword, 65% it's actually a pretty damn good amount. What I'm saying is, mentally speaking, my brain managed to capture the move sets way more easier. Like for the first time to try than the long sword ones, right? Let's put it this way. I'm not saying Great Sword is easy. That's not, not uh, what I'm saying. I feel like Great Sword is actually one of the probably one of the not one of the from from all of the ones that I tried, it's the most difficult one to use. What I'm saying though is you got to realize that one thing is to learn the moves, the other one is to learn the moves while in combat, right? Because you can learn the moves pretty easily when you're not in combat. But when you are in combat, you actually have to realize when is the ti right time to use the move itself. So that's where I think the GS is actually more difficult than the long sword. But the move sets of the long sword, to me, are not that straightforward to learn from the first time. You know what I mean? But at the same time, I can just spam it, to be honest. 
I feel like longsword you can actually just spam shit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's that's what I mean, Fatalist. That's what I mean. So in combat, the move set is completely different than just going to the training area and use the the, the weapon itself. Oh wow, what a claw. What a clutch claw, bro. Oh, we only got 5 minutes. Okay. And then, th you gotta realize that also you have another thing, which is some weapons make more sense than others for different people, right? To me, the longsword kinda was... N it, it was not kinda, it was not at all what I was expecting it to be. It's really different, I feel like it's really different from the longsword that you have in Rise. Like, the movement is not there comparing to Rise, for example. And the only game that I used longsword was Rise. So, for me, the learning curve for, for this one is not only in combat, not specifically in combat, but the actual moveset, for me, the learning curve is way bigger than the GS. But then again, the GS, I cannot spam everything, and with the longsword, I feel like I can just spam if I want to. Doesn't really matter. Yeah, yeah. For the long sword, it is completely. It really is. I know, Dark, but I mean, I, I'm trying to get to everybody. You gotta realize there's a lot of messages and I'm playing at the same time. I'm trying to read all the messages, Dark. If I miss one, I'm sorry. Even for every weapon? Absolutely. Absolutely. The dual blades are completely different in Rise as well. Those are the only two I can talk about, because they are the only two that I used in Rise. Uh, no, that's a lie. I also used Arch, Arch, uh, Bow and Arrow. Like, uh, like, Archer type of thing. Uh... I will have info on how to get the Impact Mental on next stream. Don't worry about that, Dark. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. I will get it when I get it. I I really don't give I I really don't care too much. I'll get it when I get it. It's a good one to have for sure, but uh not worried about it. Uh did you guys capture it? Yeah, you did. Okay. I might as well just get this. That was a nice one to finalize, man. Loved it. Happy. I understand. I understand. Which one? Rise? Yeah. Yeah. I don't like. I don't like. I, I didn't enjoy Rise. I'm going to be honest. I did play for a couple of uh, a couple of hours. I have like about, I think, 40 to 50 hours on the game. And I, I didn't enjoy it, bro. Thanks for the hunts. No, thank you, Nizov, man. You must try Lance and Gun Lance. I will get to all of the weapons, Dark. I will get to all of the weapons, bro. I, I don't want to be rushed, bro. I really don't want to be rushed. I'll get to everything when I get to everything. Um, I mean it more fun just to play the game and enjoy? Yeah, yeah, for sure. For sure, Happy. World, though, it's way more enjoyable for me. Even for every weapon? Mm -hmm. Take your time. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. That's what I'm trying to do. Just enjoy the game. But um, I see both both points, by the way. Uh, Fatalis and, and Happy. Uh, I do agree with Fatalis. Uh, and just because you're, you're, I feel like you're missing one point, Happy. Which is... Even if you master every weapon or you master one or two weapons or whatever, those two weapons that you mastered might might have been 
way more easy for you to understand than for a uh, another player, right? For example, uh, I might enjoy dual blades way more. Yeah, I'm doing that. I'm doing that. No worries. No worries, bro. Like you might enjoy, you might enjoy. I might enjoy dual blades way more than I enjoy, for example, longsword. But maybe I will discover that I'm actually way better at longsword than I am to like on dual blades. And which is not gonna happen, by the way, because uh, for me, in, mentally speaking, I don't understand the. I really don't understand the move set of the long sword in this game. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. And you can, you can say, I'm just, I'm just providing my opinion on your guys's opinion. That's pretty much what I'm doing. Yeah, it's 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 down to preference. At the end of the day, it is. Like even if I if I me or anybody else the, is not as as good as they would like to be in their favorite weapon to use let's say they can just use the favorite weapon that shit doesn't matter of course if you do want to have a little bit of a challenge and like actually learn all all the weapons i feel like that's a good thing to do as well because that way not only you have more versatile playthroughs that you can do but um, you probably will enjoy way more the game than you already do. I'm, I'm already enjoying a little bit more of the game now that I have started playing with different weapons. Like, I would probably... I, I would probably not be enjoying the game as much if I have not changed to Greatsword in the meantime. And just stayed with, like, Dual Blades. Yes, I feel like you do move. I feel like it's in between dual blades and greatsword. You have a lot of orange horizontal space and more fluid. Whereas, yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. But it it is like from my understanding, people do feel like longsword is easier to learn, even though it has a, a big a big skill uh, ceiling. But um, and the greatsword is not that easy to learn. And it also has a big, like, skill ceiling. Will when you get used to it? Yeah. Took a while for LS to click for me, to be to to be honest. That's what I mean. I don't. I'm. I'm. I'm gonna be honest. I don't like my brain cannot understand the move sets they have on the long sword in this game. To me, it doesn't make sense. It's too too many horizontal moves. I don't know. It just doesn't make sense. In my head, that is. It might it might make sense to a lot of people. I mean, it's the most played weapon in the game, is it not? You if you if lot less with the less. Yeah, yeah. Because the great sword, there's there's one thing. And I feel like longsword also has this, but I'm not at the skill level with the longsword to to actually confirm or deny this. But from my understanding, the little that I played with this this weapon, like it, it has a little bit of what greatsword has, which is the timing that you gotta hit by learning. So by learning the move sets of the monsters, you will manage to have great timings on hitting the greatsword attacks. And I feel Longsword also has a little bit of that, but at the same time it has a little bit of the horizontal and a, a little bit of the movement from Dual Blades, for example. That's how I feel about it. That's how I feel about it. Yes, it's it's the most... So yeah, there you go. So, I, I, don't, I, I don't usually process information uh, the same way as, as, I don't know, as most people do. So that's why a lot of things that you guys mention, I cannot understand. And I'll just say it, I'm not understanding, can you specify something? Because my brain kind of functions in a very specific manner. Uh, I am a quick learner, but I have my own methods of learning something, you know? Exactly, Tylo? Okay, there you go. So that's why I was trying, uh, like, I was kind of agreeing a little bit more towards your opinion on the weapon than, than Happy, but I understand Happy's perspective. LS is crazy mix of all, yeah, that's what I feel about LS. But I couldn't like confirm or deny that shit. 
SNS is the real mixture. Yeah, I agree with that as well. I feel like LS, but then again, I haven't tried all of the weapons, so I, I, I my, my, my opinion is as good as the fucking rotten egg. I don't know, but um, in terms of LS, I feel like having tried dual blades and having tried great sword, dual like the long sword is in between both of them. That's my feeling. At least that's that's how I my 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 brain processed it. But then again, um, I don't know who said it. I think it was Dan. It comes a little bit to preference at the end of the day. But at the same time, what do you feel like you're good in? Yeah, no worries, Nizov. Uh, what do you feel like you're good at using as well? For example, I love dual dual blades, but I don't think I'm proficient at them. At least not yet. I might be somewhat good, but I'm not. I don't think I'm proficient at it. I feel like I could be way better since since it's my main favorite weapon. But unfortunately, that's not how it works. Unfortunately or fortunately, I, I don't think it really matters, to be honest. Um, but yeah, 